kiss in the bed. Mom, what are you cooking? All right, guys, so I'm getting ready to make my BLT. Here's my tomato. I'm gonna wash that up real good and slice up some tomatoes. You know about the Brioche bread at Kroger's. I bought an avocado. I may use it. <laughs> and then here's the rest of the bacon that I'm not gonna use. I, um, so this is five slices of bacon that I cut in half. Now, I may not use all of it, but it's best to have more bacon than you need than not to have enough so i cut up five pieces and cut them in half I'm, i said i was going to fry it on top of the stove but i'm going to put it in the oven actually let, let it bake i have the oven set to 375 so i'm going to let this cook up and get nice and crisp and i'm going to um bring you guys back and show you my new toaster that i bought as well all right all right guys i'm back so let me show you my toaster so i bought a hamilton beach two slice toaster okay bought it from Kohl's stainless steel I think it was $21.99 so it'll get the job done all right we're going to put two pieces of this brioche bread in here and make us a nice BLT okay my tomato my avocado lettuce iceberg lettuce is in the fridge and I'm sure you can use other lettuce on your uh, BLT if you want to I mean I know you can but this is my new Hamilton Beach toaster. I'm gonna get ready to try this out and see how the BLT comes out. All right, I will be right back. The bacon is in the oven. I forgot to tell you that I layered the pan with parchment paper and I cut the bacon uh, five slices in half. So I'm letting that bake at 375. I want it to get nice and crispy. Nothing like fresh, crispy bacon on a good old BLT. And we're gonna have some Lay's potato chips, honey, and a Fago pop. See y'all in a minute. All right, I'm back. So I have my tomatoes and my lettuce. I've washed it, sliced my tomatoes. I put some black pepper on my tomatoes. And I also sliced up the avocado, okay? So I think I'm going to put some of the avocado on the BLT as well. So there you go. And I'm going to be using olive oil mayo, okay? And of course you remember I bought my Lay's plain potato chips if you were watching the vlog on the other channel because I can go check out that vlog. We went to Kroger and bought the uh, bacon and everything for the BLT. All right, guys, the bacon is almost ready. I'm going to drop this bread in the uh, toaster, and it'll be time to eat. So the bacon is still cooking. I want it to get nice and crisp, so I think I'm going to flip it over and let it continue to cook because I want my bacon crispy. Okay, so someone beat me to the last Fago, so I, I'll be drinking just regular H H2O out of my coldest water bottle. Use cold Phyllis to order you one. So I have my water in here and I like to put some of this uh, organic apple cider vinegar in there. In with the water, mm-hmm. So we'll be having water today with the BLT. Nothing wrong with that, pour a little bit of that in there. And then I'll shake that up and we'll get ready to eat our BLT, all right? No fago today. I'm gonna go buy some though as soon as I finish this video, okay? I'm cheating, guys. I had to get one little piece of bacon out of there. <laughs> it's not as crispy as I want, so the bacon is still cooking, but... Mm. You're growing hungry. <clears throat> and someone said, I'm not gonna call no names. The other day, uh, yesterday when I ate the chicken and noodles, I didn't really chew the noodles, I just swallowed them down, so let me make sure I chew my bacon. Mm hmm You know who you are. Okay. <laughs> Guys, look at that bacon. That is some good looking bacon. It's almost where I want it to be. I like my bacon nice and crispy. All right, the bacon is out. I think it's crispy enough. And the toast is in the toaster. The toast just popped up out of the toaster. Let's make our All sandwich. All right, guys, it is time to eat. The BLT is done. Let's see what it tastes like after we bless the food. Father, bless this food that we're about to receive for the nourishment of our bodies. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right, I got my coldest water bottle because I don't have any soda. <laughs> Which is a good thing, I guess. Okay. I have the avocado on there. I didn't actually put it on the sandwich. I had an extra tomato slice. But this thing is huge. 
Let me see here. Okay. Got me some Lay's plain potato chips. You know, that's my chip of choice. Let me know what yours is. Well, someone told me in the live on the other channel, they like Ruffles plain. And I like Ruffles too. So, you know, they didn't have the small bags of Lay's plain. Um, hopefully these won't go get stale on me. Okay. Press this down some. Let me see if I can bite into it or do I need to cut it in half. I'm going to try to bite into it. Look at that. Oh, this is a good one. All right, here we go. Mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. Mm. I got that in case I need to. Cut it. Mm. That's good. And this extra tomato, I just put some black pepper on it. I like to cut up tomatoes and have them in vinegar. Mm. Let me get a piece of this avocado. It doesn't have flavor to it. Oh, but this is good. Look at that. Mm, 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 mm. Hmm. I guess this is a breakfast brunch late one. <laughs> That's some good thick smoked bacon. If you're going to do a BLT. Mm. Your bacon has to be crisp. Okay. Mm, 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 mm. The chips are fresh. Mm -hmm. Cold as water bottle, baby. So how are you all doing on this Friday? What you got going on? Let me know. Oh, this is good. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. Let me chew my food up real good. <laughs> mm. I can taste the black pepper that I put on the tomatoes, and it is good, guys. Do you like BLT? I've never had a BLT with turkey bacon. Have, has anyone ever had that? And I just don't like turkey bacon. <laughs> If I did quit eating pork once ever, this is not, if I did ever stop eating pork, the one thing I wouldn't quit eating is the bacon. I say, okay, I give it all up but the bacon. <laughs> so guys, I said on the other channel that I'm going to start a segment of videos, um, old YouTube beefs or disagreements. Where are they now? Mm. Did they make up? I think that'll be good. Mm-hmm. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. Let me get this and then I'm gonna eat that um avocado. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. That's good. So, mm, 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 mm. the videos will consist of me going through, including my own squabbles, disagreements I had with people, you know, and see, are we still disagree? You know, are we still in disagreement or what? <laughs> And other people because you know YouTube is for entertainment purposes only everyone so there's been a lot of entertainment on the YouTube streets 
Mm hmm. That's what you guys come here for entertainment. Don't take this serious or personal, okay? It's never personal, it's strictly business. Clicks and views, right? <laughs> it is what it is. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm. Delicious. Mm. Get your coldest water bottle, please. The link is in my description. Support your girl. All right, let me give me another bite. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. These chips goes perfect with the BLT. And I have a lot of the um well It's still at least a half a pan. I only ate what you saw me eat yesterday of the um, noodles and chicken. But they were a big hit. Mm -hmm. So make sure you try that recipe. I know a couple of you said you would. It's easy. No boiling and all of that on top of the stove. You just put it in the oven and let the oven do its thing, honey. You can make chicken and noodles and chicken and dumplings in the oven. Come on, somebody. <laughs> mm. let me get this in over here it's kind of it's getting a little soggy but that's okay <laughs> mm. it's still good mm. I didn't think I would eat all of it but I'm hungry and this will hold me over honey Mm. And I had plenty of bacon on here. I'm not running out of bacon. Mm. It's good. Mm-hmm. Make you a BLT and let me know what you think. Mm. The brioche bread was bread was good too. Oh, look at this. I'm down to the last. Oh, and it's falling apart. Oh, well, somebody wanted it. It fell apart on me. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. Good to the last bite. Mm hmm. That was good, y'all. All right, let me clean up a little bit, come back and read a few comments from the chicken and dumplings video, chicken and noodles video. All right, guys, I'm back. Let me see what you all had to say about the chicken and noodles video. Some of you all have watched it and left some comments. Let's see here. Deborah Tumor, I have never had this before, but you make it look real good. I think I would have made some brown rice instead of the noodles, just my opinion. Okay, you can do it with rice as well. Yellow rice, brown rice, white rice, whatever you want to do. Whitney D, definitely trying this one for me and the girls. Looks good. Okay. Julia Martin, that looks, that looks so good, PP. I usually cook my chicken and noodles on top of the stove, but I got to try this recipe. Keep cooking and sipping in the kitchen. You know I will. Let me sip some of this coldest water bottle. Mm -hmm. That's all I got today is water. Invisible Chef T. Hey, she said, hello, sis. The baked chicken and noodles look delicious. I cook mine the same way, but on top of the stove, and I use chicken breast. I definitely will cook it in the oven and tag you in it. Bless it. Okay. You know, I don't cook with chicken breast uh, because it's always a little too dry. Or maybe I'm not seasoning it up and letting it marinate good enough. So I'm going to come on in and watch one of your videos because my chicken breasts always come out dry. 
flawed and blessed. Looks amazing. I'm definitely making this. Thanks for sharing, PP. You're welcome. Beautiful queen. I have to try this. Philly Phil looks delicious. She radiance. Hey, Philly, this looks delicious. Thank you, Crystal. Great recipe. Looks like an up-and-coming dinner for me. I know you'll do a good job because she cooks very well. Living life with Teal. Hello, this is a nice recipe. Your food looks delicious. I enjoy watching. Thank you. WTF. Hey, YouTube of the week. They said your one pot dish does look delicious and easy to follow along. I enjoy watching. Thank you. PJ, it looks great and healthy at that. Thank you. The Fellowship Room, and I'm a new subscriber over there. It says, I'm going to try this. Much love from Memphis. What's up, Memphis? Kizzy, Philly Phil looks delicious. We'll try this recipe for sure. Thank you, Kizzy. Hey, you know Kizzy. She don't eat a lot of things, so if I cook something she want to try, hey, I'm doing good. Coleman, hey, Double P. This here is one of my granny's favorite dishes. Looks delicious. Thank you. Debbie said, one of my favorite meals. Good vibes said, looks yummy. Luther Brooker, I will have this yummy. Phyllis Clem said, looks good, PP. And let's see here. Sherry Lester said, I know this is tasty. Got my mouth watering. Take care. Honey, it was seasoned, and when you warm it up, it smells so good. Mm, mm, mm. The flavors and the aroma. Daryl Haynes said, you are a great cook, EWPP. Thank you, Daryl. Zakia said, have a pleasant weekend, everyone. Anita James said, looks good. Smitty Smithful said, hello. And Deborah Cooper said, hey, EWPP. All right, guys, if this is your first time stopping by the channel, make sure you like this video. Give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment so I can read it on the next show. It helps me when you leave comments, all right? Now, I need you to hit that red subscribe button. Hit that red subscribe button again. Why? I need you to turn on your post notifications so you'll be one of the first to know whenever I drop a video. You want to be notified whenever I drop videos. Make sure you go subscribe to my other channels, Cause I Can, and Come On Somebody with PP and CMA, and you got to check out my brother, Cooking with Comedian Michael Allen. All right, guys, you never know where I'll be, what I'll be cooking, dipping, sipping, baking, frying. You just never know where your girl Philly Phil will be, what restaurant I'll pop up in, what city I'll be in. But one thing you do know, and you can run tell everybody I said it, say Philly Phil, say we are always welcome in her kitchen or wherever she may be. Thank y'all for watching, and have a good weekend.